Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Janet Yong, and in my channel, I share about feng shui, ba zi, entrepreneurship, as well as personal growth in terms of communication, motivation, and leadership. In today's episode, I'll be sharing the 2021 forecast, the year of the golden ox, for those with the dragon and the snake within their charts. So if you do like this video and like what I'm sharing in my channel, please remember to click on the subscribe button, like the video, share it with your friends if you find it useful, as well as click on the notifications bell so that you can receive a reminder whenever I upload new videos. So let's move on to the next segment where I will share more about what's in store for the dragon and the snake in the year 2021. So, as usual, please remember to download your Ba Zi chart from bazicalculator.janetyong.com or scan the QR code that's actually shown within this particular slide to get your Ba Zi chart. And when you download your Ba Zi chart, you will realize that there are four pillars within the chart. And what do these four pillars mean? For the year, as I mentioned earlier on, it will represent basically what's happening in your bigger company environment, the industry environment. In, in the family, it could represent your grandparents or the relationship with your grandparents. In the month pillar itself, we are basically looking at your relationship with your immediate superior. If it is in your own business, then it will be with your clients, at home it will be with your parents. And this is also the pillar where we can look at whether will there be a change of job. So if you are concerned about career and what's going to be in store for you in 2021, the animal horoscope that you should be looking at is the one that is within the month branch here. So then we have the day, which is your relationship with your peers, your spouse or your partner. And for the hour, it is relationship in terms of with your subordinates, with your children, people younger than you, all your followers, if you are an influencer, as well as the actions that you'll be taking. More of this is actually discussed within my first 2021 general forecast video, which I'm pointing to the link here right now. You can click on it and understand it a little bit more. So let's move on to today's 2021 forecast focus, which is actually for those with the dragon within their charts. Now, those with the dragon with their charts actually comes in the 8th. And then depending on which aspect of life they are looking at, we will basically investigate it a little later. So first, let's look at the stars. The dragon actually has got the nobleman moon star. This is a great star for getting helpful people to help you. Or if you are actually giving the help, you may receive it many times in return. And the moon, it's also about money related stuff. So therefore, if you need help in career related, wealth related, investment, business related, and you have the dragon within your month pillar or your hour pillar, it's great to take that first step. Now, like in a few of my other videos, you must also remember that at times noblemen can be just teaching you a lesson. And in life, we have to go through at times failures in order for us to reflect and make mistakes. There are a couple of people who commented that they are pretty depressed or sad because they do have the animal horoscopes that are not so great stars. But I think these are the years that are great for building our foundation. If you think about the stock market scenario, it is not always up, up, up. It's time when there's consolidation in the market, when it is the best opportunities come. But if we never prepare ourselves for it, we will never be able to ride on the high when the good stars come aligned within your charts. Don't you think so? Now let's then look at also for those with dragon, what are some of the not so great stars within their chart? Within their chart, they have both the slender star and the entanglement star. So these basically means that from a relationship perspective and the communication perspective, those with dragon within their charts would be important to note 
how they communicate with others and whether they engage in office politics and it's definitely one year to lie low so that you don't get into issues or trouble in terms of politics with others. So if you look at the dragon, if it is found within the year pillar itself, then it has to do with maybe a little bit more of uh, complication in terms of communication in the bigger company environment or industry environment. But at the same time, you could probably get helpful people from within your social circle or from basically people who you know are born in the year of dragon and have generally the helpful people that can support you when you are asking them for help. And if you have dragon within your charts, then definitely you can seek career mentor help, time to build your career for a better future. And if it's within the day, it is mainly communication with your peers, with your spouse, watch out for the slender star and the entanglement star as well. And if it's in the hour, if you are looking at what are some of the good investment areas, this is a good year to seek help because you have the nobleman star and at the same time take the right kind of actions so that you can invest and thrive in the future. So from a flying star perspective, the dragon is situated within the Southeast Palace. And in the Southeast Palace in the year 2021, you have the Misfortune 5 Yellow Star. So it is crucial that number one, you do not spend time in the inauspicious sector of Southeast and some of the other afflicted sectors like I mentioned earlier on, as well as the areas that will cause disagreements and aggressive behavior. So let's then take a look at where are the inauspicious sectors within the year 2021. The Southeast, like I mentioned earlier, has the misfortune star. So it's crucial that you do not spend too much time there or do not do knocking, drilling and renovation. So there were questions also asking me, are we talking about facing the Southeast direction or basically being in the Southeast sector? So here I'm actually referring to being in a sector and not necessarily facing a direction. And how do you discover this sector? It's basically taking your floor plan, taking maximum width, maximum length, and standing in the middle of your home to find out which directions point to southeast. I'll share more about this in the next few weeks when I come up with a specific video on how to identify the auspicious and inauspicious sectors at home and in your office. And the other thing that the dragon should remember is do not spend too much time in the number three argumentative energy sector like the Southwest or the number seven star, which is actually in the Northwest this year. Next, we will look at those with the snake within their Pazi chart. It's ranked just one above the dragon in the seventh place. And similarly, it has a mixture of both good and bad stars. So the snake from a career perspective has excellent luck because you have the achievement star and the recognition star. So this is definitely a year for you to focus on career building, on building recognition at work. However, because of some of the inauspicious stars like the combat star, the legal star, the conflict star, the slender star. All these has to do with actually having difficulties in terms of relationship or being misunderstood for your actions. So therefore, it's crucial that whatever that you do when you are trying to achieve something, the end goal, getting the recognition that you want, that you may be basically upsetting other people. Now, at times, this cannot be helped. So the only thing is if you're entering into a legal contract, be careful when you're looking at some of the terms and conditions. And to help avoid that, one of the key things we need to look at is generally also spending time in the right sectors. So I'll move into that a little later, but let's look at the snake in the various different pillars of your master chart. If the snake is within the year, Therefore, you have social circle of friends or the company that you're working for is receiving a lot of recognition and achievement. Tap on those. 
in terms of learning the new kind of skill sets that your company requires or basically tap on your friends recognition and basically maybe the person will be able to help you in whatever it is but the key is not being too aggressive such that communication breaks down between you and your social circle when we look at the snake as well as the ox is actually a combination we call it the friend combination support and help from people within your social circle of friends especially when you are trying to strive for the achievement of a specific goal or recognition the next then is that of the snake within the month now within the month it's excellent news for you because you can definitely gain recognition and achievement in the year 2021 where you definitely will be able to receive help from your immediate superior especially with the friend combination if it is the day that has got the snake branch itself then it is basically maybe your spouse or your peers that are getting the recognition and it is also a year with the combination of the snake and the ox where you have excellent relationship with your peers with your spouse at the same time then if it is the hour then it is a great year for you to take the right kind of actions spend time in the auspicious sectors so that you can achieve what you set out for 2021 learn the kind of skill sets for you to get recognition as well and definitely if you are aiming from the perspective of being an influencer going onto social media especially when we move into period 9 where branding online is crucial this is a great year because our can also represent your followers and you will gain great relationships with them if you look at the snake from a feng shui flying star palace perspective it is also situated within the southeast palace similar to that of the dragon so it is crucial then for both animal signs to basically avoid the inauspicious sector and i have also included the link within this particular video description itself you can visit our website eatreasures.biz if you want to understand a bit more and what other things you can use to protect yourself so let's look at actually the auspicious sector if you are trying to gain achievement and recognition then one of the greatest sectors to spend time in is actually within the south sector of your home if it is the living your bedroom but definitely not if it is the kitchen unless you are within the cooking business or you're baking as a business and you're trying to grow your brand name because the number one star represents career and recognition the other good sectors are the west the center that has got heaven luck and the number four star in the east sector which is about building relationship with other people it is crucial then for you not to spend time in the afflicted sectors especially when you have all the argumentative entanglement and combat star in the number three quarrelsome sector of the southwest and the northwest which has the aggressive accident and impulsive behavior sector as well as if you can if possible not the other two afflicted areas of the north and the southeast which has both the illness and misfortune star more about this like i mentioned earlier is within a treasures.biz you can read up more about the 2021 flying stars and if your bedroom or your main door is there how you can protect yourself if not stay tuned because i'll be coming up with videos on explaining how to basically find out these sectors how do you activate if you spend time in the right sectors and how do you protect yourself if you are located within the sectors itself so here is the end of my video this week on 2021 forecast for those with the dragon and the snake within their charts I hope you enjoyed this video thank you for your time and please do click on the subscribe and like button if you do like this video share it with your friends as well as click on the notifications bell so that you can receive a reminder whenever i upload new videos till the next week where i will be talking about the next two animal horoscope the horse as well as the goat i will see you next week goodbye